Now to a health alert. After years of recommending adults take aspirin regularly to prevent heart attack and stroke, the U.S. Preventative Services Task Force is changing its tune. And Tarek Miner is joining us. Tarek, what is this brand new guidance? Well, Mary, a low dose of aspirin daily used to be recommended for those 60 and older. But now scientists say they see little benefit for most healthy people. In fact, they say it may contribute to a risk of bleeding in your stomach or brain that goes up as you get older. The task force now says people over 60 should not start taking a daily aspirin for primary prevention of heart problems in most cases. And they say if you're between 40 and 59 years old, you need to talk to your doctor about whether you should take a daily aspirin in specific circumstances, like if you have a significant risk of heart disease. So how do you know if you fall into that category? Well, the American College of Cardiology has a risk estimator tool that you can use. You're going to need to know a few things about your health already, like your blood pressure and cholesterol levels. You can find a link to this tool. It's inside this story on newsforjacks.com. Meanwhile, the task force says if you've already had a heart attack, a stroke, or other heart or circulation problem, and your doctor has put you on daily aspirin, don't stop taking it. They say instead you should talk with your doctor about what these new recommendations mean for you.